Hey guys, it's Sports Death, and welcome back to Don't Bite Me, Bro. Uh, I'm gonna put together a quick video today. Uh, ooh, okay, so this is the first time I've actually started the game in a couple of weeks. The dog is doing too good. He needs to be fed. How you doing there, puppy? Okay, and we need food ourselves. Uh, last time we played, I rescued a bunch of school children. Oh, puppy, stay out of the way. I'm harvesting corn. And my base got messed up pretty bad, because there were a bunch of zombies that attacked while I was out doing stuff on my own. And, uh... They messed up the base pretty bad while I was rescuing the school children. So... I think we gotta fix it before I go off and do other stuff. So let's do that. Because I know I had more guard towers than what we currently have. Alright, we've got some corn. We eat food ourselves and not die. Drop off our resources. Okay. Wow, actually, if I leave resources here, maybe my guys can heal themselves while I'm gone. Yeah, I've done a lot of exploring in this game, but I haven't done a lot to go back and fix the base up. This is probably a good idea, is to go back and, and do that now. Alright, 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 corn. Alright. Yeah. Because we are a football player, the sheriff, the school teacher. Oh, I can plant trees! Oh, I need that because I am running out of resources in the area. And I was like, man, how, how do you deal with this once the, the trees are all gone? Well, apparently, you can just plant them. That's not what I was looking at. I want the trees. There we go. Ah! <gasps> So it is kind of Minecrafty. I like Terraria. Where you can plant your own resources and come back and harvest them later. So I wonder if that means I should get rid of the little logs and stuff. Because they're potentially taking up room that I could plant new trees. And they're not coming back. Uh, and I don't think you actually get wood for them. They're just in the way. They're there to kill time. Which you need, because hordes are coming. Okay, and they have to be a certain distance apart. Come on, puppy, move! You gotta plant trees! Okay, so we'll leave those for now. Let's see if we can harvest some more stuff. Yeah, because I've completely deforested the area. I didn't know you could plant trees! That And there's the bone again. The random bone for no apparent reason. Right. And I think the trees grow the longer you... Oh, yeah, yeah. No, they definitely grow, because these were not that big last time I played. So, I guess a good strategy here is only attack the completely full-grown trees, because they give you the maximum amount of wood for the least amount of effort. Okay, so I did play this game in multiplayer yesterday for the first time. Uh, I played with DJ, and um, there is a bit of a problem when you're playing more than one person. Uh, person. Person! Uh, when you're playing with more than one person, uh, the camera is really twitchy. Like, you can get pretty far apart, and the camera pulls back really far, so it's hard to see what you're doing. Uh, so it makes hand-to-hand -hand combat pretty tough. Um... But then the other problem is that if you want to go to another map, um, if you take a look, like, there's a transition down here. Oh, it's not there. Okay. So if you actually want to go to another map and you're playing with more than one person, you actually have to, like, I guess vote in a way to get there. So, yeah, you have to vote in a, a manner of speaking in that both people have to be standing at the same point at the same time in order to get it to transition to a new screen. Um, and it's a little bit wonky in that where you're standing is very dependent on um, whether or not it's going to load the next map. So, okay, so we need more guard towers. I'll put one right here. And we, I learned the hard way not to put them up against the fence. There we go. Can we upgrade that? I need 
need to upgrade this guard tower. Alright, I guess that's not happening. I'm gonna go out there and fight some zombies. Do I have any ammo? I don't even know. Holy crap! And I'm out of ammo. Alright, I don't even know how I got so beat up and so out of ammo. At the last episode, I think I had plenty of bullets. I don't think I even died. I just kind of came back to where... I didn't even know there were super zombies in this game. Holy crap. Oh my god. Ah, I think I know what happened is I dropped all my bullets in the shack. There's that weird loading glitch again. Oh my goodness. And then they destroyed another one of my towers. So I was going to say, it actually gets very hard to sustain your camp after a while because, you know, there's a lot of resources. Alright. Uh, put that tower back. Apparently you can put the tower on top of the corn. Okay. Alright. I'm going to plant a couple more trees and then we're going to run out of here and see if we can accomplish something today. No, I don't want a fence. Although... Expanding the fence might be a good project for later. Let's put down some trees. And when we come back, there should be plenty of material to build with. Alright, if I do a second playthrough, I'm going to have to remember that, yes, you can actually go through the trees. Oh, and I remember I got a key to a sheriff's station. And that was over here. It was actually right next to where the sheriff was. Oh, hey, thank you, giant tree. So I wonder if I can unlock this. <gasps> I can! Okay. This is interesting. Ooh. But that's also locked. Alright, so I have a crap ton of bullets. But I can't get to the super happy guns in the back. Wow, I have some bullets. There we go. Oh, I can't destroy the benches, but I could use the wood. Yeah, so I like this game, but you know, it's designed to be a multiplayer game, but it's also glitchy when you play it as multiplayer. So it's a little bit weird, and then yeah, it's a little bit glitchy in general. All right, so I figure today's goal is we're going to check out the church because. I think to beat the game, you need three orbs. And one of the orbs, I believe, is in the church. So you're going to go check that out. I'm going to try and make today's video a little bit shorter, because I know everybody's out there playing God of War, <laughs> including me. <laughs> but, got to make you videos. And I was thinking about doing a God of War video, but I think everybody else is doing God of War. So it's just like, if I do that, I'm going to get lost in the crowd. Oh, the church is north of me. Okay, got to go north. Where's my dog? <sighs> We're gonna be glitchy today, huh? You steal my dog. Alright, let's go in there and see what happens. Okay, so when you explore an area like the church or the cave, there's a little pause indicator next to the horde menu. I'm thinking you don't have to worry about the horde. Please take me to your camp. You're a... Alright, cowboy. Maybe I trade the cowboy in exchange for the dog. Where'd you go? He said, please take me to your camp. So I said, yeah. And then, like, he didn't appear. He disappeared. Did I have to click on him? I probably had to click on him. There we go. Yeah, there's, there's not a lot of explanation in this game. You just kind of have to roll with it. And I can drop off some bullets while I'm there. Because I think they actually need the bullets. Alright, let's go! 
Come on. Come on, partner. We're going to get you to the base. Where I'll drop off some of this ammunition. I wonder if I can make it not take all of my ammunition. Because I also need ammunition. I need to blow stuff up as well. Mission complete. Oh, that's great. Follow me, puppy. Okay. Alright, so yeah, I think we need to upgrade. We need some more fences. I was gonna do something else here, but you know what? I think it's time we expanded our horizons. Let's see. Let us put... Fences here. Oh, one more this way. And we gotta beat that tree down. That way. Now, it's not perfect. And I'm probably not going to get all the way around the camp, but... It's a start. And that way... No, no, I don't want another tree. At least not yet. Fence. There we go. Ah. It might slow them down just enough that a new guard tower might be useful. And actually, let's put a new gate. We need a gate. Okay. Put a tower. We'll kind of nestle them inside the fence. There we go. And we'll put another tower down here. Uh, oh, I don't have enough. Alright, so we'll let that go. Now I'll go back and explore the, the church. I was gonna just go straight through it, but I found a guy. Oh, ammo. I have plenty of it. They probably don't have any. Uh, okay, it's, it's getting weird again. Alright, so I don't need to drop off ammunition. Okay. The game doesn't have a whole lot of explanation. You just gotta have to run with it. So I think the next time I play... Oh, the horde is here. I might as well kill the horde. Protect my newly created fence. Because, you know, it's important. Where are you, horde? I know you're coming. I can smell the deadness on you. Zombies always stink. Horde approaches. Okay. I like how I got sidetracked by building. I'll explore that church. No, I won't. Alright. 24 zombie. Oh, crap. Alright. Uh, the, the giant zombie, I can just kind of, like, push him around. Oh, no! My guard tower! How did they get through the fence? They got through the fence. How did they get through the fence? Oh, they didn't even break the fence. They just warped through it somehow. I mean, I know they can walk around it, but jeez. All right. Uh, I could put the tower back up. Do, 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 do. Tower. There we go. Okay. So we put the tower here. Ah, no, no. I just had it. There we go. And we upgrade the tower. No, we upgrade the tower. There we go. I need resources. Uh -huh. so, yeah, I can see why you would not get really far in this game if you're playing by yourself because. There's a lot that has to get done in a very short amount of time to do it. And if you didn't know how the game worked in the beginning, like, you know, 
you could repopulate trees and all that goodness, I could see why you might have some problems. Come on, puppy. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. There's all this wood here I'm trying to pick up. Oh, my goodness. So, yeah. I like the game. It is a little glitchy. A little bit on the glitchy side. All right. So let's put a gate up here. Gate door. Because you want to be able to get in from both sides. Then, you know, I need more walls. If I'd have known these stumps were going to be such a problem later in the game, I would have destroyed them earlier. And now I'm just putting down random bits of fence that don't work. Oh, or I could just move it. Wait, no, no! Why am I getting all, like, pulled back? What? Camera angle! Why are you doing that? No! Stop it! Look at what it's doing! It's, like, yelling at me! This game is really... It's fun. It's free. But it definitely needs a little bit of refining. Oh, wait. I can just go this way. No, I don't want another tree. Cancel. I'm gonna leave this be. How did I lose all that health just walking around and like clicking on things? In fact, I'm still losing health. How, what? I don't. Am I out of corn? Yeah, it's so hard just to keep the basic survive. I yeah, I'm losing health. I'm just standing here dying. again. Alright, plant four corn. Come on, doggy. Food in the house. Uh, get out of the way! Okay. We're gonna try this church one more time. Make a run for it. Hopefully our guys can survive their own Impending dune without us. Okay. Zombies is coming. What did I... I got stuck on nothing for just a second there. This is really, really weird. Ow. Oh, yeah. So not only did I not kill the zombie... He bit me in the face. All right. The good news is they're going to give me a whole lot of bullets, which is cool. Alright, nobody else hiding in there. That's fine. Nope, wrong button. Wrong button. Is that Mario? Did I just shoot Mario? Zombie Mario in the face. Oh, I'm full on bullets. Okay. Oh, yeah, that was probably not... I should probably not run up and smack the, uh... The barrels there. Alright, now we know they explode. Oh, crap. And I might actually even be able to use that to my advantage if we shoot the barrel. Yep. Do I have a reload button? I don't know if I have a reload button. Okay. Oh, pick up the bones. Kind of, sort of. Hey, what happened to the dog? Does the dog not follow you in here? The dog doesn't follow you in here. I guess it would be too easy if the dog was here. Because, you know, he'd just run through and kill everything, and he'd be fine. Hey, what? Wait? Huh? I saw a sewer grate just for a second, and then suddenly I didn't. Alright, now I'm under the church. 
Okay. Alright. I used that barrel to kill one thing. It's a you! Undead Mario! Okay. Here we go! Okay. Also, if I have a full tank of gas, why don't I just get in the car and leave? Oh, what am I buying? Oh, I actually have enough... I want the sword. Yes! So... I've got the Nimbus. Okay, so it's stronger, but it takes a little bit of a long time to, uh... To reconnect there. I don't know what the rest of this is. Protection? I can... I can buy protection? Defense. Alright, we're, we're gonna increase our defense. I got a shake. I don't know if that's permanent or not. We'll buy that too. Protection. Alright. Let's do it. Oh yeah, definitely easier to use the sword than a, a, a board. Ah. It's got a lot more reach. But you do have to watch the cooldown. Okay. Here we go. I got my sword. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to throw your skull across the, the universe. Oh, I don't like that. that like, he looks like he's gonna explode. Oh! Oh, he shoots purple. He shoots purple at me. I don't like that. Ow, yeah, ow. Ow, shoot him. Shoot him! Why did you run out of bullets? Why don't you reload? Oh my god! Okay, I did kill him. And what, what about you? Why are you over there in the corner? Is that you in the corner? Is that you in the spotlight losing your religion? <laughs> Does anybody out there even get that reference? Or am I just that old? Oh, okay. Alright. Says he's losing health? I don't know. I don't understand the icons. Oh yeah, that didn't help at all. Good job missing! Okay, alright. Take the shot. There we go. Is there anything in the coffins, or is it just fun to hit them? I think it's just fun to hit them. Okay. I see... A campfire? Ow! Ow! I touched a candle! And it burned me. And why can't I just pick the candle up and then use it for the campfire? Okay. Alright. Whatever. We're gonna leave the campfire alone. We're just gonna kinda hope that I get through this without dying. Alright, I see... Alright, I guess it's to the next area. Ah, alright. So the sewer grate is an area transition. And I guess the further down you go... I can't light that on fire to cook food. Oh, there we go. Alright, so I don't have to light it on fire, I just have to, you know, stand next to it with food. Alright. Bang. Okay. Alright. We got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. One more. Oh! Oh, crap! Oh, crap, he's on fire, and he's fast. Why are you fast when you're on fire? Why are you fast when you're on fire? Go away! Go away! Stop chasing me! Stop chasing me! There you go! Just die! Just die! Nobody likes you when you're on fire! <sighs> Alright. Yeah. Oh, come on! There we go. There's only two zombies. You shouldn't even have to panic at that one. Nothing new. I feel a little bad desecrating these graves. Alright, so I think he does actually have, like, a food meter. Because he does lose health after a while. 
And I guess that makes sense, but it's a very quick food meter. Like, you'd have to be eating constantly. Oh, he's on fire. He's in fire. Chase me. Chase me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. It's Captain Bad Touch. Stay away. Stay away. There we go. Okay. There's an orb down here somewhere, and I'm gonna get you. And when I get you, I'm gonna be... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. All right, so there's no room to run here. There's no room to run here. We're gonna have to take him out. Oh, no. Because I get... No. Okay. 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 Very, very carefully destroy the candles. Okay. Oh, stop. Stop. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not going to die here. We're not going to die here. We're not going to die here. I'm going to take you out. Somehow. Alright, I'm just going to stay away. I'm going to play keep away. I'm going to play keep away. I hope there's no boss fight, because I do not think I am ready. Wow. Yeah, I am not ready. I would definitely not take a boss. Is it, is it a random jug of milk? I don't know! I don't know! Oh, I forgot a bone. Get the bone! Okay. Oh, thank God. I can eat. If I had food, I could eat. I don't. Alright, there's a box in the corner. Maybe there's food in there. No, it's a skull. Alright. Game is being mean to me. Alright, but yeah, you see how he gets to the top and there's a transition change? When you play multiplayer... Ah, uh, ha, ha, ha. When you play multiplayer, there's a little icon that appears. It's like the screen flashes a little bit, and then... You just have to uh, both be standing on the same part of the screen at the same time. The problem is that it doesn't always line up right. Like, I could be standing up here, and the one on the right would be flashing. Because its, it's hit detection is a little off. This is a really fun game, but I, I think it needs some refining. It's not quite polished. Okay. Uh, I still see smoke on that side. I can't go left. I can't go left. Okay. What am I buying? Nothing, because I'm out of... Alright, I'll buy Vitality. Did that heal me? Can I pick it up? I... don't even understand. Defense. I don't... I don't know. Oh, okay, I got my hit points back, somehow. Oh, okay, you can go in here. Oh, it's a boss. Oh, it's a giant zombie made of zombies. Okay. Alright, well, I have a sword. Gotcha. Okay, I'm gonna have to take it easy. Because... The sword has a very long recharge time. There we go. Okay. Oh. Oh, is that it? Really? Oh, I thought I was gonna actually have to deplete every zombie on his body before I could get it. Okay, so I beat a boss! I think I'm still going to lose this game, because the number of hordes coming at me is incredible. Alright, let's get back to our base real quick. Yeah. Run, 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 run. Level we'll save. See if any of the trees I... Have... Oh, oh, you're big. You're big. Why are you big? Holy crap. The tree smasher. Okay. Ah, now that I have more range, maybe I won't be like horribly destroyed every time I smack a tree. Those things still take way too many hits. All right, back to the base. Back to the base. Why again? Puppy is hurt. He was absolutely fine, and then for some reason he was hurt. I don't understand. 
Alright, we'll fight off one more horde. There you go. No, I don't want the stick. Why would I want to go back and get the stick? The stick seems kind of stupid at this point. Alright, the horde's going to come in a minute. Let's see. Put up more wall bits. I don't know how much it's going to help me. And I'm out of resources. Okay. I almost got an exterior wall where I, I've extended things. And two gates. Alright. Word's going to be here any second. Come on, Horde. Oh, no, he wants to eat my face. We're not going to make that easy on you. Oh, now they've got some of those spitter guys, too. And, of course, it's going to come on my most unprotected side. Wow, look at the dog go. Look at him destroy everything. Alright, if I can just distract the zombies, I might be able to keep them from attacking my defenses. Oh, wow. I don't know what that was. Something exploded. Oh, the big one's getting close. I have to take him out. Oh, no, you don't! Gotcha! Yes! Okay. Alright, guys, so that's it for today. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I apparently need to uh, do a lot more exploring in this game, and definitely a lot more base building. Uh, there were things that if I had known them in the beginning of the game, I would have concentrated on a little bit more than I did, uh, like, base building and, and building up the walls and stuff like that. But I might do a second playthrough at some point and see if I can do better. Alright, so hope you guys enjoyed this video, and see you next week. Bye-bye.